again, they come up with some really clever stuff. And people, to be honest with you, they snub them because they're like, oh, all right, really budget range stuff. But this is like £16.50 for a padded buzz bar bag. But it has some really good features. Okay, first and foremost, you've got the main compartment. Now in here, I have, hopefully you can pick this up on the video, you've got your bank sticks, I've got, got my Fox adjustable buzz bar, three Fox alarms, again adjustable Fox buzz bar, um, I have also made some modifications to this as well because I've actually screwed, tapped and um, threaded um, to screw your bobbins actually into the buzz bar. The main reason is if you're using a goalpost setup, you can then have this bobbin hanging off the buzz bar itself. Anyway, enough about that another day. I've got the two extending bars which create the pod, and these are the Witchwood um, chunky aluminium system which is perfect if you're fishing on really hard ground or you're fishing on staging. So I can create a pod, I can fish singles, I can have a goalpost set up, basically anything and everything that I could ever want to use while carp fishing is in this little green buzz bar pouch. So that's all the inside of it. Let me just put that because that just slots in there, like so. That's on there, that goes there, and then the rest of that nicely folds over. But the best thing about this buzz bar bag are these two external pockets, which in here, I've got my bobbin case, sounder box all nice and protected as it's well padded and in this larger section here I've got the backrests another three of the Witchwood short bank sticks so all of that just nicely fits inside this external sit pouch but the issue that I have like on some of my other previous videos is it just strikes me that something very simple just gets left off because if we look at this the one issue that these bags have is there's no handle you haven't got a handle at the top you haven't got a handle if you want to carry it that way so I've modified this bag as soon as I got it I've got a piece of old webbing from one of my other bits of fish and tackle and I've cross stitched it and sewed it on. So now, a nice sturdy handle, carrying it down to the bank, chuck it in the boot of the car or put it in one of my big, big holders. So there we have a review on the NGT buzz bar bag. Um, if you want to have a look at any of my other videos, just type into YouTube, Cruzy, C-R-U-S-E-Y. Um, there's other things on there, like I invented a boilie cutter, other bits and pieces, but you might find it interesting. Anyway, thanks for watching, and all the best to you guys.